Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel SQR Daily and today I'm gonna show you the MSI Afterburner settings for the GTX 1660 Super to get around 31 mega hash or can we get the 32 mega hash rate? So let's find out. So this is my MSI Afterburner settings for the GTX 1660 Super. And first, we need to set the power limit to 60%. So if you don't set this to 60%, for example, 100%, the power consumption of the GTX 1660 Super will be around 100. But if you set it to 60%, it will be around 74 or 75. 60. Then, as you can see on my power consumption, it is only 74 watts. So this is important for uh, to reduce the electricity cost. For example, in my country Philippines, the the electricity the electricity cost is around 0.20 US dollars. So it is uh, expensive compared to other countries. Then the next one is the core clock, which is the negative 50 megahertz, followed by a memory clock. This one will increase uh, the mega hash of your uh video card so in my cut the video so in my 1660 super i do have a 1100 and this is very uh stable as you can see on my uptime which is 19 hours and 17 minutes so almost 24 or almost one day so this is very stable and it will give you a 31.5 megahertz around that then if you want to get a 32 mega hash you need to set it to a 1200 for my experience 32 so we hit the magic 32 so in my experience uh, around 30 minutes average it will crash but uh, my maximum would be at two hours before it goes crash so if you really want to hit the 32 you can try these settings and check if your card is capable of doing that without uh, crashing. So, but the, I think the safest number would be D1100. And it will have a 31.5 or 31.6 mega hash. So if you like this video, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel SQRJLY for more 1660 Super updates on mining not only on ethereum and i do have also a 1660 ti i will gonna make a video for that and i do have a 2070 super and rx 5600 xt as well so thanks for watching